Welcome to Dart University. Engine schooling 101, we're gonna show you some good tips and tricks. We're gonna talk about head studs and main studs. There's a lot of good reasons to use them, and that's why people have been doing it for a long time. First, you can get some real high tensile steels. You can get a lot of clamp look, especially when you're making a lot of power. Well, second, you're putting all your wear and tear on the nut side, because this is what's going into your more expensive part, like your cylinder block. So this just goes in with a slight snug fit, and all your torque and all your friction on threads happen on this side. So here's one that would go in an iron block, pretty conventional. Now what I would, I'd do is I'd run this down and I'd start to bottom this shoulder on my first threads. Now you want to be careful because you can bend that first thread down. So this is just going to go down snug and an iron it's okay. So here's one for aluminum. First of all you can see I've got more thread engagement here. So I've got you know more threads to pull on. Well the second is this bullet nose feature. This is nice, because I don't bottom out a shoulder. I bottom this out in the bottom of that bolt boss. Then I put a little bit of preload between the bottom and the threads. Now my stud is engaged, and it's ready to start putting my head gasket down and my cylinder head down. Now these are all blind holes, so I don't need to put any sealant here. I can just run these down dry, just give them a little bit of a snug. You know, Dart has these available, so if you got an aluminum block, you can get these through them. Real nice. Now, a trick a lot of guys do on high-end builds actually do something similar in the iron that they do in aluminum. They'll just drop a ball bearing in the bottom and that's what bottoms out and gets instead of the shoulder, the bottom out on that ball bearing. So kind of a cool trick. Once you've got your studs in, you can use a stud installer or if you've got an Allen feature, you can run them down that way. The studs are in, put a little assembly loop, now you're ready to torque everything down, clamp it for good, go have some fun. <music>